So today I'm cooking because guess what? It's about three weeks until Ramagama Ding Dong and we're gonna have to be eating good because we'll be starving all day. So I thought, I don't know, sometimes, listen, you know I'm not really a cook, but every now and then I just get a sudden urge to try and cook something. And it's usually when I spend the day at home and the kids are in school and I feel like what are you nurturing doing? them. I feel like nurturing them and giving them memories of like, oh, mama's cooking was so good. Like today I was supposed to just make spaghetti bolognese, but Sid said my spag ball is so shit. So I thought, okay, let me try a biryani. This is gonna go horribly wrong. Have some faith, Sid. Honestly, have some faith. Today I'm gonna try to make a biryani for the first time in my life, despite being married to a Pakistani man for the last nearly nine years. What is that chicken? That's already, it's lemon, uh, lemon and garlic chicken breast steak. Did you marinate it yourself? No, I didn't. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get all our bits and bobs out. So, pan, I just, I've only, I don't have many pans. <laughs> right, I'm following a recipe, okay? This is a really realistic, realistic Dina cooking video. This is not like, oh, take this and a pinch of this. This is literally how I cook. I just typed in biryani recipe and making chicken biryani came up. And I love reading recipes that are literal like that, just, numerical order, no faffing about or bullet points. But I did click into it and then it got complex. So I went back out and we're just gonna follow up to step five. Then by that time we'll be warmed up so I can click into it and read the complexness for the rest of it. Otherwise I'll get overwhelmed. Add oil to a pot or pressure cooker and heat it. That is so simple. Uh, in this kitchen, we like to use fry light. <laughs> Why is that funny? <laughs> For our life. Because it's one calorie per spray. So if you put in about a hundred calorie, a hundred sprays, it's just a hundred calories. What accent is that? So you know how I always go into accents randomly? Apparently that's the Udhud thing, ADHD thing. Sid calls it Udhud. Apparently that's the ADHD thing and I just recently read about it. Anyway, one, two, that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, ten. Whoa. 18, Why? 19, 20, 20, 20. Well, come on, let's let's be real. Not sponsored by Fry Light. Hold on a minute. If I was to use Fry Light, not sponsored by Fry Light. Oh, I don't. What have. are you looking for? I've only got sunflower oil. We're not going to do that. And this one is delicate butter flavor, which I love to do because sometimes when I make rice, I stick a dollop of butter in the middle. So You're this, disgusting. That's quite, shut up. You always love it. <laughs> okay, that's enough. So now we just have to heat it. So we press the buttons. Child lock off. 14 seconds. 11. Done. Quickly read the next instruction so that doesn't burn. Add onions and fry. Shit. Onions. I just hate prep. Right, I've got one red onion. I'm here with me looking at your yellow chicken thinking that's all the prime she needs. I found one brown onion. We're making biryani, honey. I'm prepping. Where's my apron? Quick, I'm gonna heat it on low then so it doesn't burn. Right, I actually, I don't have an apron but I have uh, a, wait, a waitress skirt from when we had to film that video. We've got props in this house. There's just props left, right and centre, innit? You wanna be a waitress? Go for it. You wanna be a chef? Go for it. You wanna, you wanna be, be a gym goer? Go, go for it. You wanna be a kettlebell? RKC1 master? Go for it. You wanna be a vet? Got five cats, mate. You wanna be a mum? Got two kids. Wanna be a wife? Dickhead behind the camera. <laughs> <laughs> That's not funny when you do that. That's like what Hassan does, it's not funny. <laughs> what was so, that? Did you see that? It went. You put it on the spot. What are you doing? No! Do not. Oh, these fingers are going to get obliterated. Nah. Babes, has this gone off? I'm one of those people who has so much vegetables in the fridge, but they're all gone off. Your butter's burning. It's not, and it's oil, stupid. I hate, I hate doing this. I hate chopping, chopping. I hate it. Oh, oh your fingers are gonna get Do you know what, babes? Done for. Wait, look at me a minute. Camera up. I read a really funny TikTok or meme the other day, and it goes like this. It goes, when people say, this is my quick go-to recipe, then they start chopping up an onion. <laughs> <laughs> so true. So true, so true. Did I deliver that well? No. So Sid is really good at chopping onions. So do you want to do it? <laughs> Have you seen the state of my hands? I don't mm. think my fingers give a fuck. Oh yeah. <laughs> do you know what I mean? 
Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean, darling? Do you know what I mean? Why do you keep saying like, that? Like, fair enough. Oh. Remember when Tusi went through that phase? Oh, going, this enough. is... The, honestly, this is a cringe fest right now. But look what I hate. I hate, like, I have to put this in the food bin now because this is already annoying me. And that's how you dice an onion. I'm not done dicing. It's so you are yet. dicing? Yeah, well, I'm trying to. <laughs> but I'm not done. Do you have to... The, the aim of the game is to cut them up as small as you can. But as quick as possible. So... You're doing it wrong. But who said? Says who? Like, like literally, who said? It will also have the same flavour, won't it? You think it will have the same flavour? Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> just, just roll it up. Can you roll it up? Can you roll it up quickly? Any slower? Please, babes. You want to push this way. All right, okay, ready? Go. Ah, oh, lovely. Add onions and fry till golden. Okay. Next, add chicken and fry till the colour slightly changes to pale. Add chopped tomatoes, yoghurt, red chilli powder, coriander leaves and mint. Shit. Have we got chopped tomatoes? Does she mean in a tin or does she mean... Imagine I was this tall. Let's not do that to ourselves now. Chopped tomatoes? Probably going to need tomato puree at some point. Are these chopped tomatoes? Shall I chop these tomatoes? What are you asking me? Chop. They're mouldy. Shit. This is why I can't cook very well because the prep is just mental. Oh, here we go. Literally. Ah! Chopped tomatoes! Wow! This kitchen is all the gear, no idea. I literally just got so lucky then. Where are you going to chop the tomatoes then? They're not, they're already chopped. Oh, okay. It's marinated with lemon and uh, lemon and garlic, I think. Chicken smells good. What do you think? The chicken's not cooking. The onions are. Watch, now we're going to add the chicken to the pot and start frying them till they turn pale. But these won't turn pale because they're very marinated, so... So I've just got to wash my hands first because how the hell do people do things? Always rinse your recycling before you put it in the recycling bin. So I'm just getting some more ingredients out because I read it and... Just add chopped tomatoes, which we have. Then you're supposed to add coriander leaves. And I don't have coriander leaves, so I'm just going to add coriander, ground coriander. And you're supposed to add mint. I don't have mint, so I'm going to add a bay leaf instead. <laughs> and then you're supposed to add red pepper, but I don't have red pepper flakes. So what are you adding? Red chilli. I don't have red chilli, so I'm going to add crushed chilli and cayenne pepper. You should make a... Cayenne pepper? You should literally make a cooking channel. Yeah, alternative. No. So you don't have to prep, but you can always make the same thing. I know what it's called. I know the perfect name. What? What? Zero prep. That's fucking delicious. <laughs> oh my God, zero prep with Dina. Because I follow so, any so recipe, dumb. but we just find alternatives. Because you'll still come out with a meal at the end of it. You will. The problem is, is it going to be edible? Wait, so we also add yogurt. So remember what you were telling me the other day when I thought I made a biryani and you were like, no, because there's no yogurt. I was like, huh? There's yoghurt in biryani, I didn't know that. Just don't stain my eye like me, bro. Don't stain my jumper fat. How annoying is it that we have proper mixed race kids, but their taste buds are so white? Is that not so depressing? Like, I grew up eating yummy food, can I just say? Our kids are just... I want plain pasta with butter on it. Isn't it? This is mm. annoying, you know? Don't look at the disorganised drawers. Don't know what's in there. Okay, I've also decided that I'm gonna just... Oh, it's ginger! No, no, I need garlic. Oh. Garlic bell dead. Get some garlic bell dead. Look, it comes out. Like puff puff pears. Let me see. Look. Watch this. Puff puff pears. <laughs> yeah, you've never smoked in your life, so I don't know what you're on about. There are some things that the audience on YouTube do not need to know about me. Instead of the mint, we're gonna get a bay leaf. What should I do with you? few bay leaves for flavours. We need the coriander. I don't have actual coriander leaves, so we're going to have ground coriander. I love coriander in food, to be fair. What? Is that not how much you put in? Crushed chilies. A witch's cauldron. Yeah, no, there we go. But the crushed chilies don't... Will cayenne pepper be sp spicy? Cayenne pepper? This is like a barbecue biryani. It's a barbecue one. <laughs> Ever heard of a barbecue biryani, anyone? No, because I just made it up. You did this all wrong. Who said it's all wrong? I bet you bet money if it comes out the same. I bet 
Obviously, we're going to film Sid's reaction. Sid's, um, oh. not reaction, what's it called when you have Sid's taste test? Uh. I'm just finishing this pot, that's why I stuck the spoon in. Because the pot is finished. Then I'm going to open up the new pot, which is on Ken. It's on Ken. Look, on Ken. On this Ken. one was ski. We're also using on Ken. Ski. On Ken. Yeah, add chopped tomatoes, yogurt, red chili powder, coriander leaves, and mint. Cook till the mixture turns thick and dry. By Swasti. Swasti. That's, Mas, a, that's a female. Name, might as well sure. be Margaret. Let me go on step five a minute. It's funny, I haven't seen one bit of garam masala. There's no garam masala in this. Should there be garam masala? Definitely Margaret. Oh, it says one teaspoon garam masala or biryani masala. Okay. Let me get some garam masala into this bad boy. Where's our garam masala? I know we've got some. Oh, here it is. We've got a whole jar of garam masala. Oh, lovely. Beautiful. How much? One teaspoon, she said, so a bit more. Garam masala? Garam masala, garam masala. It's actually looking like the picture. Look. Can you see? It's actually looking similar, minus the leaves, but we don't have real leaves. So. <laughs> it's but it's looking actually... like the picture. Look at my picture. Yeah, I know, it just looks like sick. Don't be rude, Sid, because you're going to eat this. <laughs> you're the one eating the sick, honey. Think I'm eating this? I ain't eating this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Layer drained rice all over chicken to separate. Oh. And then I add water and then it all boils together. Is that it? Yeah. Like Maluba? Yeah. The Arabs literally copied the biryani and they call it matluba. Well, she went all fancy when you open up the actual recipe. I'm going to get the rice now, really. This is actually quite easy, isn't it? I mean, basically, if, you, if I was to follow her steps like properly, it's a bit long. But actually, and this is a great little tip now, if you're someone like me who gets overwhelmed by cooking and steps and prep, if you just open up any recipe and follow any recipe but throw in alternatives to whatever you don't have or miss out some steps <laughs> you'll still would have you still would have cooked a good meal what are you doing that's rice for mika what are you doing rice for Hannah. that's not how you make a biryani it is rice for what are you doing right now sid rice for dina <laughs> what are you doing? now if mama comes over <laughs> you're listening if mama comes over rice for mama but now there's only a tiny bit left, so I might as well do the whole thing off. You literally read the instructions and did completely opposite to what she said. No, she said put the drained rice in here, then add water. And that's literally what I'm doing. She said add three cups of water now. I'm doing what she said, I'm not. Well, on here, one cup. <laughs> I don't think that's what she, she said. <laughs> you meant that's not a biryani. That's what she said. <laughs> oh my. But that's what she said, two cups. Guys, I feel like any more cups is actually too much guys, water. this is a train wreck. Biryani, Do the instructions. you have the stuff at the bottom, like the chicken and stuff, and then you put cooked rice on top as a layer. She didn't say cook it. That's how you make a biryani. Well, she didn't say cook it. So then when you, you lift the lid, it's just rice, and then underneath is the chicken or whatever else you've added. But she didn't say that. She said cook it. That's a biryani. Well, I think there's different versions, Sid. Well, I'm actually nearly there. And guess what? She adds lemon at the end, so I'm gonna get some lemon. Oh, fuck. Look at the lemon we've got. <laughs> you buy these then, because it's the 22nd of Feb, but they feel all right. There we go, that's how we'll fool everyone. Ha 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 Okay, wait, babes, quickly. Huh? I've never seen a biryani like this in my life. I actually have a bag of other spices from last Ramadan when I overshopped, and then I have nowhere to put them. So I just stuck them in this bag because they're all open and like annoying. Bay leaves. Should we just see what we've got in case we can add more to make it more? Lebanese spice spice. Oh, she did say cardamom. Yes. She said cardamom, guys. So I'm going to put two. How many cardamoms would you put in? Two, isn't it? Because they're really strong. Is cardamom really strong? You put like three. Whole cloves. She did say put one clove in. I'm putting one clove in. We've got saffron, babes. I could, I could do saffron infused milk. We've got saffron. Saffron, I've got saffron. I'm gonna make saffron infused milk. Hold on a minute. What are you saying right now? She said, put 
Oh, oh saffron saffron flower. Milk. What are you doing right now? So it's like saffron, it'd be so yummy. I've basically found all of the ingredients she had, but just slight alternatives. But I've actually added even the cardamom. I'm at, wow, I actually have. It's handy to have a bag of forgotten about spices for, you know, when Ramadan comes about. Didn't need that. Well, you did, but you Didn't made it this. wrong. <laughs> Didn't you think you're original? <laughs> it's like a met luba. <laughs> we will come back to that in about five minutes and see how it's looking. And then we'll keep coming back until it's time to fluff it up and watch. I bet money is going to be delicious. Bet money, Sid. Had a bit of a quick tidy up. Now I'm just chopping up some lemon for the end to put on just on the top of the biryani. To make it look. Your fingers. This actually makes sense because the chicken was um, lemon and garlic. Uh, marinated, wasn't it? Have a look. Oh, nothing. <laughs> but it should work unless there wasn't enough rice. Put some pasta in, what do you add it? Well, I've done that before. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember when I made? It was literally rice, there wasn't enough rice, so I had to stick in some pasta and then lentils as well. And it ended up being like a proper random fake kushari. Yeah, literally. Do you remember that? And you kushari. ate it and you were like, mmm, this is nice. It is nice. There you go. Not everything has to be like proper. Otherwise, where are inventions and recipes made? People like me, who just figure someone else out and then one of the things works. Look at my mini diet cokes. I saw them. This mini is cute. Because sometimes you can't have a whole can. My face moved with the noise. It's <laughs> You know when it gives you head rush? <laughs> Rice at the bottom. Oh, it's working. He's a bit longer. We need it all to soak up. Have I got too much liquid? <sighs> Is there too much liquid? <laughs> Is it? Do you know what? I'm going to put some lemon in to infuse the lemon. It's actually working quite well, babes. Who is it? Is it not? Is it? Well, I believe so. Sorry, but that does not look bad. We're going to keep it going to heat. Really, what I should do is turn the heat off completely now and just let it sit in the heat. I've taken off the boil completely. Good thing the lid was on that pan. In 10 minutes, that is going to be perfect fluffy rice. It might be a bit soggy. You need to get rid of the water in there, yes? There's a hole in the lid, honey. So that little tiny hole there is going to get rid of all that water that's in that pan. No, because it's still cooking. What are you talking about? Just Why are you complicating things? crank the lid a little bit. Why? To the side. Why would I do that? You've got to get rid of water, don't you? So the water can evaporate. Taste test. Bismillah. Taste test. Ha! I can't taste anything. L that's because your nose is blocked. Do it again. <laughs> My <laughs> nose is not blocked. That's because you had COVID six months ago. Just taste the spoon. Tastes nice. Not gonna lie. What I tell you? A bit tomato either. Well, it's a tomato based biryani, stupid. Definitely been, you know, long enough. Lovely. Is it soaked up? Oh, it's a bit, bit wet. It's a bit wet, but we just, we ran out of rice, so. But if you, do you want a taste? Come on, have a taste. Oh, what? It's burnt. Wait a minute. It's burnt. Everyone likes a bit of crispy edges. Can you see the crispy? It actually looks all right now. Am I going to eat that flipping leaf as well? No, that's just decoration ones. That's disgusting. Don't say disgusting about food. Say alhamdulillah. Are you Ahmed, shaping it? Ahmed Rabbina. I'll give you presentations, Habibi. Do you want a fork? Do you want a bit that more? It actually looks all right. Do you want a bit more chicken for the protein? Shouldn't have diced them. Because of all of the Should have diced them. That you don't do. I have to lift your spirit. There's quite a lot of lifting. That's a good one. That's a good one. I'll give you that, babes. Oh! oh! Did you just see that? You wiping the sides? Pretty good and then eh? Okay, come on then. Properly try it. Here, you can have a second onion and all. Onion? Oh, what? You can add the lemon. <laughs> this is the final plate. I added a, a bit more just for aesthetics. And Sid's gonna fully try it now. I'm gonna feed you, hubby. Okay? Okay. Dig in, hubby. Yeah. You've had a hard day, you have today. Dig yeah. in. All the camera work. Dig Whoa. in, love. Dig in. Bismillah rahman rahim This so, isn't a biryani, by the way. It is a biryani. It's not. Oh, it flipping looks like the picture, not gonna lie. 
بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ذكبت ذكبت هو يا دريبلين must be good what's the chicken like I'm taking the silence as a good thing it's nice it's, it's edible it's not I, I can tell you like it to be fair you chat shit for the video I know you like it mm. now you are it's a good meal I would eat it yeah and then let the me taste the flavors are a bit mad <laughs> wasn't my recipe <laughs> it's nice that Talk. taste of the it tastes of chicken it's just tomato puree lemon and garlic <laughs> lemon and garlic lemon and garlic <laughs> to be fair you did marinate the chicken but the rice is actually all right the rice is okay. It's literally fine. I would eat the rice. You eat the whole thing, honey. For sure. Guys, I'm telling you, this is not a fail. It doesn't look like the picture. Well but done, I'm telling dude. you, don't well, patronize me. I didn't need well, this. Well done, dude. Honey, honey, honey. By the way, if they you don't You did eat, good. Don't you that. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if they don't eat that for dinner, you're making the spaghetti bolognese. Did okay. you just hear that? You're going to make it, okay? Let's see. Let's go close. Oh, wow. This is like... What do you think then? I think it worked out well. You did really well. I think it's fine, honestly. Any more than that, what's the point? You're going to eat it in 20 minutes and shit it out. Honestly, what's the need? Tastes good, mate. So I hope you enjoyed that cooking video. Let me know if you want more cooking videos because, as I said, it's Ramadan. Also, a lot of you know about my clothing brand, I Like Me. I'm going to leave you guys a little discount code that you can use at the checkout. The discount code is going to be Dina is nice and it's going to give you 15% off on the I Like Me website so you can get your sets, whatever colours you want. Yeah. By the way, I'm wearing medium hoodie, medium joggers. The joggers are a bit too big for me though, but still super comfy. So yeah, Dina is nice at checkout, 15% off. Also, as I said, Ramadan is coming up. If you want me to daily vlog or do daily videos, I need you to leave me 30 video ideas that I can do every single day like my plan is to make a list what's this video tick it off for 30 days straight they have to be actually doable though bear in mind so if you could leave those suggestions below that would be perfect i'm literally going to call it day one blah 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 whatever it is that you suggest okay let me know if you like this kind of video where i'm basically just being me and trying to do things and if you do like it can you actually like the video i never ask you guys to like and subscribe all of that bleh stuff but Apparently, if you actually like my videos, apparently it helps my channel. So can you actually do that now after 10 years of being on here? Nice one.